Coming up next, it's a UFC featherweight division fight. Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, so, most people so, believe, yeah, his opponent is in a so, world of trouble. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tail of the tape now for this featherweight fight. So these fighters are just a year apart with the same height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 141 pounds. Body out of Atlanta, Georgia, big. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, give the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. famous arena and dating to 2016 a lot of the UFC's best have gotten that opportunity. Absolutely J.A. and when you grow up as a fighter especially a heavyweight it is your dream to headline MSG and fight for the heavyweight championship of the world. I got that honor and I can almost feel the ghost of Muhammad Ali, Joe Frazier, all those great fights those guys had at MSG. I felt as if on that night that I retained my championship I became part of that fraternity. The greatest heavyweight fighter to ever step foot in Madison Square Garden. It was an honor and a pleasure, and it felt amazing to join that fraternity. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. And he landed the right hand there. 
perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, huge head kick. Oh! Oh, big left hook there. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Right hand upstairs. range with that kick attempt. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Came with inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. And there comes the separation now. Three minutes. That's a big strike right there. There's no give on that leg kick. Spinning back fist is there. Can't take many of those, you better check. Oh, massive kick to the body. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Nice counter shot there. Oh, head kick blocked by Lee. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big kick lane. Right hook attempt. That's a miss. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Oh, huge block! And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Just misses with the punch by Lee. Right hand upstairs. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Right punches there. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. All right, there's the clapper. 10 seconds to go. He's able to slip the left there. Horn sounds for the end of round one. A lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All right, next round is underway. He really did a nice job defensively in the previous round. You're not always winning with defense in MMA, but the crowd was ooing and eyeing as he moved that head off the center. I mean, line. it was defensive brilliant. Yeah. I mean, just the ability to move, to roll his shoulders, to get his hands up and block his head as his opponent was trying to attack him was a sight to behold. It was a thing of beauty to watch a guy with such a vast understanding of defensive fight. Oh, 
another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Come on, keep moving, keep moving your Lee's way. kick to the body, that one blocked. Oh, big punch land. Big leg kick land. And just misses with that big right hand. Get ready, get ready. He's looking for the high kick. Big punch land over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Big leg kick land. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, uh, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punches. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. What a body kick. Caught that. Now there's danger in that too because when you start reaching down to catch that kick, here comes the high kick and then you're in a lot of trouble. The right hand just misses. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. I mean, he's cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Good punch, Lance. Oh, and he is getting tagged repeatedly. Nice combination of strikes up top. Oh, beautiful combination up top. I don't understand why the guy is not moving his head. Get your head moving, son. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Very tricky when he throws that body. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh! Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. It's blocked. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Switching stances here. Great punch. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Great upper body movement defensively, slips another strike there, and offensively he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent. Not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away, but that's a testament to the head and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Look at him whip this hip into that kick. Rips the body there for good measure. Oh, big head kick land. Big punch lands through the middle. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. He blocks the punch. Oh! Round and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment 
to try to change the tide of this fight. in bunches and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Well, missed on that one. Lands the right hand. Oh, just misses with the kick. Liver kick. Still nice body kick land. Lee's oh, and he lands another kick there. Beautiful work on the feet. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Man, look at the redness now, almost immediately on the right side of his body. Nice punch lands over the top. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Just misses with the straight left hand. Pretty good right hand. Look at the rip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. And he caught the kick, we'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Nice punch man to the top. Head kick. Just out of range with that right hook. Big kick. Oh, and there is the kick. That one checked by Lee. Just out of range with that right hand. Well, he has really started to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Oh, that's a nice strike. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Nice. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. His hands are down. High kick, high kick. Blocks the shot. Score that takedown for you, man. Just unable to quite find that range. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attack. Just missing on the counter there. Dig and kick. Seems to have timed that counter pretty well. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. He 
he gets stung by that leg kick. Just misses with the left hook. Oh! Oh, he might be what out. from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Head kick lands. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Big kick land. Man, look at the size of that bruising on his body. Oh. Inside leg kick is good. Kick blocked by Lee. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Oh, and he caught the kick. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Head kick there blocked by Lee. Nice loop and punch. Right hand upstairs. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Both fighters throwing heat now. Beautiful straight counter. Single collar tie there. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, that right hand is on point. Beautiful body kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. Oh, nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his... Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Spinning back fist. Campbell. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, no! Nice straight punch. 
checks that leg kick. Take down now. 30 seconds to go here. Beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Ten seconds to go. Connects with the right. And he caught the kick. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. 20 minutes in the books. All right, so it was all about the liver kicks and the body attack in that previous round. DC, the highlight. The liver kick is a nasty kick because it only takes one to land in the perfect spot and it will shut your body down completely. You won't be able to stand. You won't be able to fight. All you want to do is exit the octagon. He better get his elbow down or his opponent's going to continue to take advantage of that weakness. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg has so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that off. Nice defense there, huge block. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Pretty significant welt to the left side. Big body kick. to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Nice, nice right hand. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Way to hide that leg. Attempts the front kick there. Ah, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. That one stuck in. Nice strike. I'm trying to kick the leg out. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, head kick attempt. Head movement prevents it from landing. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Oh, head kick attempt. It is blocked by Lee. Sneaky head kick. Back and forth we go. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Single collar tie now. Nice body kick. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Unable to connect with a right hook.
big knee to the body. Straight punch lands. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. One minute to go in the fight. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. Wow, massive uppercut. Leg kick. There's the kick, it's blocked. Lance with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shin guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Waning seconds of this fight. Beautiful fight. Visibly limping here. What a fight! Body kick right there, landed perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 49-46, 48-47, and 49-46. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Actually, there he is, the celebration is on. He tried to leave the judges out of it tonight, was unable to do that, but pretty dominant effort nonetheless. He's your winner by unanimous decision. And you've got to feel good about that. You've got to feel good about dominating every aspect of a fight and getting a victory. You should be very proud of this performance.